So I know I haven't been producing a lot of videos lately. I haven't been doing a lot of vlogging um, I, or any updates about the car, what I'm doing, what I'm up to and so forth. I think I'm going to try to do that a little bit more. Um, whenever I find the ch uh, chance and opportunity, I'm just going to turn the camera and start talking. Um, so uh, the story is I've been having issues with the car. That's the story, right? I've been having issues with the car and... I had no idea what to do. I just had no idea what to do because I was like stuck, right? Um, the story is, um, you know, the first time that we did that swap, uh, when we drove it a few weeks, I think for, I mean, I think about a month, you know, we, we were producing so much power, right? So much power that the car was so frightening, right? Um, and I remember when I put my boost gauges, um, it was showing me that I was doing point, um, what, what was it? Point 0.8, that was the maximum I would get to, point 0.8 bar. Um, it was a lot, right? And I would spin a lot, right? Like, I mean, I would, I would um, finish tires. I even changed, um, I even changed the rear tires. Um, soon after, I think within weeks I had to change because um, the car was really chewing tires. Um, so the problem now was that um, from point 0.8, it it felt like the the boost was really going away um until now i was producing like 0.6 that was the maximum i would do but then i would do 0.8 that was the maximum i would do right so now it was, it was now getting worrying i was now getting worried about it because it really sounded like um the car was getting worse and worse right so what then i decided to because now i thought it was um an issue with the turbo i mean i did a whole bunch of things i even did um i even made my own um smoke machine so that i figure out where i'm losing boost right i would pump smoke into the engine um so that i see where the smoke is going uh, is escaping so that i find and i did find places many points i even found out that my pcv uh, it's called a I think they call it a positive crank ventilation valve had a problem thanks to that smoke machine right um, and we had to buy one from the UK we had to wait weeks when it arrived we put it in and uh, it felt like there was a tiny bit of improvement but we were not back to where we were before right so um, however um, I gave my car this other guy uh, a friend of a, 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 a family friend to drive he drove and and he wasn't so fond of the sound um, that it was making. He said, no, and I think your turbo is now got an issue. And then I said, you know, to me, I was really, you know, worried the moment that he said, I think you've got a turbo issue. So we had to send it to Turbo Solutions Africa so that they have a look at the turbo, so that they look at everything and tell us what's going on. Um, this is, that's where it is right now. So right now I'm carless. I don't have a car. I think probably to be delivered in a few minutes from now because I was on the phone with them and they said they'd uh, finished um, finished working the car so but the good news is that um, my turbo is not gone that's the good news it's not gone it's just an issue of me losing boost I've been losing boost so they had to do a pressure test I didn't have pressure testing equipment so they had to do a pressure test there uh, to find out where boost is leaking is it by the intake is it you know because remember we also painted the engine as well so they had to check to find out where um, where the boost was leaking from. Um, and it wasn't leaking uh, from the um, gaskets or on the engine. It's actually they had to say that they actually said that some of the pipes had not been tied, uh, tied well. Uh, some of the clamps were not tied well. So probably that's the reason why I was losing boost. Although they indicated that the turbo um, has got a slight whine, but that's nothing to worry about for now. So which means I can really... A drive in with because I was thinking of upgrading. My plans was to do an upgrade on the turbo uh, towards the end of the year. That was my plan. Because, um, um, I mean, uh, that's pretty much the plan that I had to upgrade it at the end of the year. Um, so, what I had done because recently I bought a boost controller and I put some boost controllers on it and I was trying to crank up the boost so that I see how much power it is it is it is okay so i think the car is arriving now let's i think the car is just arrived I can hear.
okay. gonna drive you. Oh, he's, 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 so he's the one I was talking to on the phone, right? Yeah, he's the one. Okay, all right, okay. I had to drive a phone with Dara. Ah. Yeah, guys, I wish you were there. Mdara. 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 Wow, it's so oh 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 my god oh Christ uh yeah oh, true ooh, level uh, bitch oh, Morty come on we're leaving for school oh, oh everything's crooked reality is poison I, I want to go back I hate this what's his deal go to school summer I'll go in Morty's memory and do a little <laughs> Link, I think Dara. just because <laughs> just, just just because just because what don't do that about it now I want to do it immediately <laughs> Saga upper, how much bar will you make? Ah, we didn't boost it. But he told me who dance is doing what? Yeah, good up in the eighty. All right, Saga, let's go for a spin. Let's go for a spin. Put the setting to peak. All right, there's a setting to peak because I want to see peak. I don't want to boost it up for a spin. wasn't feeling the way that it felt when we got the car that's the honest truth um but in terms of responsiveness it had um uh, significantly improved uh, from what it was now doing in fact it was also um kind of misfiring uh, which meant that there was a lot of unmetered a sorry a lot of air that was being metered uh, by the massive flow sensor but then uh that air was getting lost so there was a situation of more fuel right um more fuel uh in the engine uh compared to the air that was actually getting actually getting in when the meter when the air, air massive flow sensor was telling it we've got a lot of air but we had actually less air in the engine so yes um a lot of nerd stuff but um uh pretty much that's why we were getting some kind of so that had gone away actually that had gone away and um it was quite responsive it was quite responsive from the from the from the word go um but it wasn't crazy it wasn't crazy enough it wasn't uh feeling the it wasn't performing the you know before it would make me so frightened i would think twice uh to do what i was actually doing in this video I would think twice. Um, I would really think twice. Um, but now, oh, you know, I could I could give uh, anybody this car without worrying. Of course, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. I think maybe it's because I was I'm now used to it. So maybe it's because I'm now used to it. I don't know. Um, yeah. Um, so at this point, I mean, of course, um, I'm starting to think about going upgrade. Definitely. Definitely.
Because obviously there's no way I'm, I'm I'm gonna want the turbo to go to to I'm not gonna want um to service the turbo. I'm not gonna want to go buy another turbo. Makes no sense to me. Um, because I made this as a power machine. That's the whole point. So if the turbo is gone, it's actually good anyway. If the turbo is now you know not so good, it's actually good anyway because it means um now I'm being forced to actually upgrade because I wanted to do this end of the year anyway. So I think you can see um, it accelerates um, 0 to 110. I mean, it really accelerates um, very quick, right? Maybe it's the bug that's biting me. Maybe it's the itch that's itching me. Um, but um, I really want more, right? And, you know, <laughs> um, it used to do more than this. It used to be frightening. That's the story now. It used to be frightening. So now it's not frightening me. It's just not frightening me at all. It's just not um, a crazy, crazy thing that it used to be before. Um, and it would light up the 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 the, 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 the rear wheels. It would light them up. The, that's the story. And it's not doing it. It's not doing it. It's not doing. It. Maybe I'm used to it now. I don't know. I just don't know. 